what made Coca-Cola the real thing and the global icon that is today was not only the product, but everything that was created around the product, which was definitely like a design-driven company. And I think if you fast forward to today, somehow nothing has changed because our approach to design is really the same, trying to craft that ecosystem to making sure that we are being relevant, attractive, and useful to people's lives. With the Topo Chico Hard Seltzer brand, it was our first venture into a new category. Because of that, I think it allowed us to have more freedom and a license to experiment more, to try different things and new ways of working. We originally were handed a brief. It was a simple brief that says, ready to drink alcoholic beverage is an attractive opportunity for the Coca-Cola company and it aligns with our mission to refresh the world. Just like other major companies during the pandemic, we were not able to have any in-person meeting and the greatest challenge was not being able to see them in prototype, in person. Eventually, we realized that we had this two stager. To us, stager is a virtual studio. We were able to bypass all of the photography and physical mock-up in the initial phase. The fast pace of addressing needs in a timely manner, I think that's the biggest effort that we have as a company the ways of using 3D tools to bring, to visualize the product in a fast way, I think that was definitely like a big element of success in this process. A key component to this would be the Adobe Stock, which has a huge library of 3D models that we could take advantage of. At the same time, we were able to utilize the Adobe Sensei Smart Search to upload an example of what we're looking for, and in return, it produces imagery that fits our need. With Stager, we were able to create photorealistic imagery in a matter of hours. The quality of renders is on par with what we would get from a traditional photo shoot or product photography. What that means is that we could easily save up to a few hundred thousands of dollars. Our brand leaders were pleasantly surprised that we were able to turn out at least a dozen different concepts within a matter of a few days. But behind the scenes, we knew that it was mostly because we had all these tools at our disposal and they all worked seamlessly with each other. Learning my craft as a designer, it was through Adobe products, right, since the beginning. The possibility of sending files, knowing that on the other side there will be another Adobe user this to me is amazing. It's really a true global platform. I do believe that 3D is going to be a mainstream design discipline. There will be less segregation. Applications like Stager comes in and removes and lowers that barrier of entry drastically. It truly empowers every designer.